Hello everyone, welcome back to this series of uh, our tutorials. Um, here we're going to add this clothing to this rig. Um, there are different ways to go about this. Sometimes you have the clothing, some other times you create the clothing. Um, here in Maya, if you go to the Windows tab, um, General Editors, Content Browser, you have different kinds of uh, attires here. You can pull this in, um, you can pull this in, and you can position them as you want. Right, so but I have modified one of them, and I won't be using them. And here's what I'm going to be using, this uh, lovely looking clothing here. So as it is right now, if you move this rig, the clothing um, doesn't go with it. And what you want is such that if you edit the controllers, the rig moves with the clothing, right? And here it's not the case right now. So what we want to do is take this clothing and bind it to this rig so they move together. So we'll do this by going to our outliner here. And once we've placed the clothing, we've positioned the clothing where exactly we want. Um, we we'll go to the outliner. And now you notice there are two main groups here. Don't bother about this two here. I don't know what the what it is about, but we're going to use these two groups here. The first group here is a clothing which I created. Um, the second is the rig itself, right? The rig. The controllers and its mesh so here's what we're going to do select the dress you want and locate the mesh that you want to bind the dress to and in this case it's going to be the torso of the rig so here this um this is for the controllers that's not what we want we're going to the mesh itself so we click on this drop down menu uh, and we search for trunk and we search for torso and then we go for the mesh itself and here it is right so when we select this as you can see if i go to the wireframe mode you can see the mesh in here okay so i have selected that and I will now um, move this dress right into that group where we have the torso. So I'm using a window system here. And so what I'm going to do is I will drag this dress into that group holding the middle mouse button of my mouse. So I'm going to drag this here right into this group and i'll place it in the group that has the torso that i want to bind the dress to once you've done this we're half done and the next thing to do is select dress hold your control key if you're using windows and then select the torso and then you switch to the rigging shelf, go to deforms, under deforms, wrap. So click on this box by wrap tab, and then just click on create. And once you've done that, our rig is ready, and has been the clothing has been attached to it. So if I test this, you see the dress moves along with it. it looks really nice. Right. And uh, you can use this for whatever you want. Um, you can adjust, and then you see the clothing. You see everything is turning with it, right? And so that is very straightforward. And so if you move this to the side. The clothing moves with the rig and you can do anything you want to do and then it's all um, 
combined right now. So that's the end of it. If you like this tutorial, hit the like button. Thank you very much.